told you just last week about zebra mussels being introduced to the Rome fish hatchery, but there's more to the story. News Channel 2's Kirk Tupai tells us how extensive the damage is. The Rome fish hatchery stocks brown trout and brook trout for many of the lakes and streams in upstate New York. The hatchery gets its water supply from Lake Delta. New York State DEC fish pathologist Andy Noyes tells me zebra mussels have been introduced into the system and fixing the problem comes with a cost. As long as we're using the lake line to, to supply water into our hatchery system, the zebra mussels will continually be introduced. And that's why we need to redesign this hatchery to do away with that. Because this is a new discovery, there isn't a design team or a cost on fixing the problem yet. Zebra mussels are an invasive species that spread quickly and consume algae, but they don't directly impact the fish. I think there's a myth out there that people think that this is a disease of fish. It's not. The zebra mussels are in the water with the fish, but they are not in, in any way harming the fish. They don't harm the fish, but they do impact the ecosystem of lakes and streams, and the DEC doesn't want to take any chances of spreading them. And while the zebra mussels may be small, it doesn't take long for them to get into a pipe like this and completely plug it up. The damage it could cause here would be profound because we have pipes and valves and screens and all sorts of things, surfaces that they will eventually grow on and interfere and obstruct the water flow through the hatchery system. If you do plan on fishing this year, you may be in luck. Some areas will be overstocked with an abundance of fish, while other areas will be understocked. Hatcheries around the state will stock water systems that aren't contaminated with zebra mussels, but there will likely be a shortage of fish in those areas. Andy Noyes says there's a good chance all of this could have been avoided. Likely through boat traffic into Delta Lake. It's easy to move these things around if you're near waters like Oneida Lake and uh, the Great Lakes that have zebra mussels. To keep zebra mussels or any invasive species from spreading, the DEC is reminding boaters to properly clean their vessels before introducing them to any other water system. In Rome, I'm Kirk Tupai reporting for News Channel 2.